finally found her. The woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. Because you told me to make room for serendipity. And guess what? I did. And it worked out. I mean, she's different from every other girl I've been with. You know, from the very first time I kissed her, I knew she was the one I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. Huh. So tell me about her. She's delightfully chaotic. A beautiful mess that slipped out of heaven. And I must tell you, loving her has been a splendid adventure. Her eyes, her smile, just burns right through my soul. And I want to ask her to be my wife today. But I, I don't know how. Courage to do so. What if she says no? You know, I mean, yes, she loves me, and I know it. But the only snag is I have to find the perfect words to put together and ask her. You know, I mean, what if she says no? I hope she likes it. Hello, sir. Please, um, I'm going to this address, but I, I really don't know my way around. I've been trying to call my friend, but she's not responding. Oh, no, I know this area. I'm actually headed that way. So why don't you join me? We'll get a cab and we'll drop you off. Okay, sir. Yeah? Thank you. All right. Uh, trying to not pull it from... Yeah. Thank you. No, it's... It's fine. It's fine. Thank you so much. It's okay. Thank it's okay. You, sir. Uh, my name is Barry Fine. What's yours? Nene. Okay. Thank you very much. I'm really grateful. Yeah, it was a pleasure meeting you. Same here. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Bye. Oh now, babe. You're welcome to my house. Well, our house since you're going to be staying here from now on. Yolanda. Wow. Hey, no be small thing though. So this is yours? Yes. How did you achieve all of this in such a short time? Well, you know your girl, no room for slacking. And you know what they say, when you stop chasing the wrong things, you begin to attract the right things. <laughs> and me, I was in Benin, wasting my time with that stu stupid useless boy called Efosa. Huh? Thank God you don't even use me by Benso. <laughs> God forbid. Ah, your head's drunk past the owner. Before Uncle. But, but what is the craze for Benz anyway? My friend, I don't know. But babe, Sabe, live a fossa. This is the life. Hey, my friend is living the life. Eh? Hey, auntie, Auntie, go. Eh? My friend is living the life. My friend is living the life. Look at the bini life come here. Are they Chris? No, no, not course. Mm. I beg, I beg. You, yes, you know all those money where I yesterday they throw for road, people they pick. I mean, they pluck out for true. Ah. I don't come pluck oh, for my you. Own. Pick my own joint. For where you get out of die here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, uh, Who was that guy? Who? The guy that came Oh, oh, you. oh, oh. Some guy. We, I met him at the park, so we came in together. Now, say it is that. I beg, hope you didn't give him your number, Sha. <laughs> Why would I give him my number? He's a fine guy, but trust uh, me, now, dear, he ain't well, nothing never change you. My I dear, beg, wear pesticides down. Make her your enjoy this hour. House. <laughs> Man, your house is so beautiful, girl. Landa, hurry up. It's my first interview. I don't want to be late. Oh. Sorry. Oh, come That's on. That's changed. What I was already feel right for work. Oh, you look good. <laughs> look, I'm, I'm really nervous. Baby girl, I'm looking at you right now, and all you need is confidence. Okay, wish me luck. I thought I already did. You're going to ace it, okay? They're going to love you. 
Amen. Can we go? Yeah. I'm running late. Uh, one more thing. What again? Uh, here, here. What? Oh. Okay, so take this for your lunch and your transport. Babe! You want your comeback before? You shouldn't have. This is a lot. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Let's go. I'm running late. Oh, oh you took the exit. Yeah, I did. Um, I have it. Hey, may I join you? Yeah, you can. It's for customers. Besides, I don't own the place. Okay. You don't remember me, do you? Your face looks kind of familiar. Yeah? Well, uh, the park. Very fine. Remember the parking video? Oh, on my, NA, right? my bad, my bad, my bad. I'm so, <laughs> so sorry. I have this bad thing of not remembering faces. I'm really sorry. And I want to say, I'm sorry for not being able to say thank you after the last time. No, it's fine. You already said that. Right? You already did. So, how's your friend? She's fine. Yeah? That's great. So, how are you finding your way around the city? Because last time I checked, <laughs> you didn't know anywhere. <laughs> um... I've had my own fresh year of first timers experience, but I'm learning and I'm, I'm coping. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that. Um, so, what have you been up to? I've been trying to get a decent job, and um, <laughs> trust me, it's not been easy. It's been pretty tough. Mm. And I had my first interview session today. Mm. You don't want to know how tired and hungry I am. Oh. Mm -hmm. Or well, something else. Yeah, I can imagine. The thing is that, like this city, there are loads of opportunities, but there are even more people looking for those opportunities. So it's very difficult to get like a nice job, you know. No. But I'm sure in no time you'll get a great paying job. I'm certain. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. I pray so. Yeah. So where where do you work? Uh, I'm a driver. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, I work for for one of the companies here. Oh, I yeah. see. You're lucky then. You have a job and it pays the bills. Yes. Hmm. You know? Yes. I mean, I came to Lagos to look for greener pastures, you know? And looking back, I'm much better off now than I was back then. So the move paid off, you know? And I pray it pays off for you as well. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. That, that, that's why I'm here. Yeah. Amen. So, savings, right? Okay. Went through. All right. But you know, you shouldn't have. I can pay for my food. Well, that's the least I could have done. This is the second time you're doing this, and this is the second time we're meeting. <laughs> okay, thanks. You're welcome. You're always welcome. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? I'm trying to order a ride. Oh, no, but I can take you. Oh, come on, Barry. I don't want to inconvenience you. It's fine. No, it's not an inconvenience. I promise you that, okay? You've done enough already, okay? I got this. No, 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 no. Let, let me take you. I'm offering. Okay, 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 okay. Great. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Mm. Oh boy. I can Do you move. need help? Yes. I yes. need to move the table for you. <laughs> <laughs> wow, thank you. All right. Mm. Thank you. So, uh, what kind of what kind of job are you looking at? A media firm, but I have this particular one in mind, the Barry Lawson firm. Yeah. It's somewhere I've always wanted to work at. Yeah. Oh. I've even applied as an intern when I was an undergraduate, but I never got picked. You know, I know some people that work there. Maybe I should put in a call for you. You know? Really? Yeah. Honestly, I would appreciate that. It would mean a lot. Well, 
I know some people that work at some other top companies in this city, you know, because I used to work as a driver for most of these companies, okay. you know? So maybe I could put in a call for you at all these places. Just give me your number, your email, you know, so they'll hit you up if there's a vacancy. All right. Let, let me have yours then so I could send it. Okay. My number? Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, I am. Zero eight zero. Okay. Three three one. Four six seven. Four five six one. <laughs> do you have it? Yeah. All right. I got you can send me a message or something. Yeah, so. I'll do that right to you. Okay. Thank you. No worries. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. I'm editing my CV and sending applications. Okay. So you never told me, how did your interview go? It wasn't easy. Mm -hmm. My dear, it wasn't easy. We had like a short management test, then okay. chat with management afterwards. Babes, if you see the crowd, we food already ready for work. What now did this town know? What do you expect when <laughs> thousands of graduates are flooding the labor market every day? And like you said, there are no jobs. I really hope this pans out, though. Really. I pray so. Babe, I really want to do this job. I really want to do this. is the only oh. thing I want to do. It's like my dream come true. Oh. And if this happens, it's going to be so fulfilling for me. Well, my talent, from your mouth to God's ears, it's going to happen. Don't worry. Amen. So, how did you find your way back home? Guess who dropped me off? Guess who? Barry Find. Who is Barry Find? The guy that helps me the day I came into town with my bag. Oh, the cute one. Wait, I thought you said you didn't give him your number. No, I didn't. Okay, so I ran into him, or rather he ran into me at the restaurant and he walked up to me, introduced himself, we had a chat, drinks. He kept me company, he even paid for my food. Okay. And he promised to help me with my job search. He said he knows somebody at the Barry Lawson firm, yeah. Babe, mm -hmm. are you lucky or lucky? Are you for real? Yes, babe. Ah. You just came into the city, and the first person you're meeting is a maga. You've eaten a big old. It's a big fish. So what does it do? What kind of car does it drive? Which, which big fish? Dude said he's a driver. But he said he's been driving for a while now, and he drives for big companies. So he knows guys in there that could, he could pull some strings, you know. He knows people at the Barry Lawson Wait, firm, wait, wait. So I'm sure. Did, what did you say before? That he's a driver and he knows people. Oh, so they okay, so strings. he drives himself. He drives people. He's a driver, driver. Mm. But he drives them with his own car, though. Driver, driver, proper driver. Yes. In the drive people. Uh-huh. What's wrong with that? <laughs> with his own cow. So now nah, Uber. Not really. See. Auntie, what's happening when we first come? No grip bini come here. But blessed the bini follow you come. So tomorrow, three days fast. Landa, please don't start now. What's wrong with being? I'm yourself? serious. It's not in the money you go and do Ben and Tio. Fasting three days. Ah, ah. Hello? Who? Oh, Barry. Ah, Salubwa. Anointing oil. Um, so sorry. How, how are you?
So, any luck yet? Nothing yet. Oh, okay. Well, you should keep trying, you know. One thing with this city is that anything is possible. Yeah, I know. So, what exactly is your qualification? Uh, why'd you, why'd you ask? Yeah, because I'm curious, like, you said you've been driving for a while now, and with the kind of friends you said you have, I'm wondering why are you still driving? Well, uh, you know, it's, <clears throat> well, I'm not a graduate like my friends, you know? Uh, I mean, I only did my YA exam like four years after I dropped out of school because of money constraints, you know? <clears throat> that was around the same time I moved to this city. Uh, but I only have my school cert. That's, that's all I have. Wow. It's, it's quite hard to believe. Like for someone with just the school cert, you speak really good English. And you act so well. Like, why don't you consider going back to school? I mean, you could still have a very good future for yourself and for your kids and that, have that life you've always wanted. I mean, your friends could land you a good job. You never can tell. I can't possibly go back to school. Yes, you can. There are many part-time programs you could do online, distant learning programs online, open universities. You can do that. I mean, look, I think you should consider that option. Trust me. Uh, yeah, sure. I will, I will definitely put it under consideration. Yeah, you should. Yeah, I will. Thank you for that. You're welcome. And... Um, Okay. <laughs> Whoa, why the look? Don't tell me that was the driver you went out with. His name is Barry Find and he's a man. <laughs> Nene, can you can, can you stop? Whatever it is you think you're doing, can can you stop? We're not doing... Are, are you two dating? We're not doing anything. No, we're not dating, Landa. Come on. But what if we are? What's wrong with that? At least he's honest about what he does for a living. There's dignity in labor, Landa. Dignity in labor, my black behind. Wait until you find out that he lives in a shithole. I don't care. Well, you should. He's not my man. We're not dating. We're not doing anything. Keep telling yourself that. Hello, beautiful. You're done. Okay. Uh, um, I will be there. Once I drop my boss off, you know, we're somewhere now, but once I drop him off, I'll, I'll come and pick him. Huh? Okay. All right. Bye.
from the very start You came along and you stole my heart How did I ever let this happen? I thought I learned not to let my guards down Now I'm stuck right in between In the love and reality Team. Why on earth do I have to choose? The truth is I can't live without you Can't live without you Nobody wants to be alone, be alone. With no message written on the phone, on the phone. Your heart keeps searching for a home. Why don't you let me in? Why don't you let me in? I'll give my everything to you. And there's nothing that I wouldn't do. It's a key, bro. Thank you. Thank you. It's clean, right? The yeah. toilet, yeah. the bathroom. Yeah, it is. It's right. sparkling clean. Great. Yeah. I mean, why are you doing this, bro? I mean, you're my, you're my boss. You're also like a brother to me. What I don't understand really is why you've got to disguise yourself all in the name of love. I'm not disguising. But what do you call this? What do you call it? I mean, you're rich, dude. You're smart, you're clean, you're fresh. And you're basically what a lady would want in a man. But you're trying to tell me that love exists when in real sense it doesn't even, it doesn't exist. Oh, really? Oh, no, I see what the issue is. I can see that, like me, to be fair, life has given you some haymakers to the head, right? But I still have hope, okay? I still have hope. I'm not as damaged as you are. Damaged? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, bro. Okay, look, what I'm trying to explain to you is this. Yeah, what? You trying to undervalue yourself, put yourself down, underestimate yourself, all in the name of love. That's not really the way, that's not the way to go. Why? That's because every single woman has a price tag. That's why. <laughs> yeah. Now look, you see this notion about money has no role to play in love? Yeah. That is outdated to me. Really? Yeah. And why did you think so? Huh? Because that's the way the world works. That's how it works? Yeah. Okay. Oh, come on, man. Look, why, how do you think I get the kind of girls that I get? Eh? That's, that's basically because they all have price tags. Yeah? <laughs> now, you, let, me, let me show you something. Yeah. You see that girl over there? You see the way she's all into and showing that dude right there that there's no attention anywhere else? Yeah. Just watch me as I go down and make sure she goes down with me. What? Bro, that's not going to work. Okay, see, look at the way she's looking at him. You think so? Look at the way, they have chemistry, bro. Watch me. They're in love. Bro, you're wasting your time, bro. It's not going to work. Bro, you're wasting your time. Hey, yeah, Jay, what's up, man? Yeah. Hi. Hey, damn, you look good. Thank you. All right, um, I just wanted to, you know, come around and see hi and, and all that. Um, yeah, so. All right. All right, Thank later. You. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I told you, bro. She snubbed you. Boy, I have a feel for these things. I'm a romantic. I recognize other romantics. Real, she recognize relax. real. Relax. Just watch the way she's going to come around. Come around where? She's going to come sleep a number on her contacts, and it's most especially her price tag. Bro, well, you're watching way too many movies. Okay, where's she going <laughs> to come around? Your, your house? We'll see. You're watching way too many movies, bro. She snubbed you. I saw you. <laughs> what are you talking about? Just what? When is she going to come to your house? <laughs> I don't know. We do these things, man. You do what? For your trip. See that? See that? What the f I told you, right? That's how the freaking world works right now. You have to. You don't need love. Kidding. All you need is the cheddars, bro. <laughs> what she's with her boy? This is not fair. What? You got lucky, bro. <laughs> you got lucky. That's luck. Love is real. Okay? I hear you. All right. Welcome to my humble abode. I know it's a, it's not a mansion or anything, but it's the best my money could get. Well, it's really cute. Thank you. You've got good taste. Thank you, thank you. And I know by the time you make so much more money, 
you would own a castle. <laughs> I appreciate that. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, Everyone you starts from somewhere. Yes, that's true. That's true. Uh, what can I offer you? Um, water. Water is fine. Just water? Yeah. Okay. I'll be right back. I hope I didn't keep you waiting. No, not at all. There you go. Thank you. It's cold. I didn't ask you if you wanted a uh, cold room. It's fine. Okay. It's good. Oh, yeah. That reminds me. Um, uh, do you mind scooting? Okay. Thank you. Uh, well, uh, I enrolled in a university like you advised me to. Oh, wow. Yes, 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 yes. It's expensive, but I have to say I'm very grateful, you know? I mean... No girl ever got me to go back to school. And I'm glad you listened. I mean, it's for your own good. Your future and that of your kids. Yeah. Why are you staring at me like that? Uh, <clears throat> nothing, nothing. It's just that uh, I, I don't know what to say. You know? I feel like if I just say thank you, it wouldn't be enough. Thank you is more than enough. Besides, I didn't do anything special. You did. So what if all of this is like a crush thing, an infatuation? You know, those feelings that come and go? It's definitely not a crush or infatuation. It's much more than that. How do you know that? Because every time I close my eyes and think of you, I see stars. Every breath without you is like breathing through broken glass. I can't believe you've been hanging out with the driver lately. A lot. And that you now frequent his place. Landa, he has a name. His name is Barry Find. And he's got a job, a legit one at that, okay? I like him. He's a nice <laughs> guy. <laughs> Nene, please. Tell me something I don't know already because this is exactly how we're forced to start it. Eh, 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 I beg, I beg, I beg. I take or beg you. This one is different. How so? Maybe there's something you're saying that I can't. Help me. Because I'm looking at it and there's no difference. Do you have feelings for this guy? Kind of. Have you two slept together? We just kissed and he asked me to be his girlfriend. You know what is wrong with you? You're falling for the first guy. For the first broke guy that asks you out, as if Ephosa wasn't enough lesson. I don't understand how you're supposed to go further in life if you keep being around and entangling yourself with broke guys that have no future. Happiness is the most important thing for me in every relationship, okay? I don't care about wealth, money, and all of that. I don't care. I am more concerned about my happiness. So, let me guess, you read somewhere that rich people, people in rich relationships are not happy? I never said that. That's what you're implying. Look, even the Bible says, money answers all things. Money is a defense. How many times does it have to happen to you before you learn? Nene, open, open your eyes before hunger opens it for you. Yes. And whatever this is, this, this, whatever this is, you better snap out of it because it is ridiculous. Bond, there's nothing Yeah. 
So are you really serious about this scheme of yours? Bro, I have no idea, man. Did you get me? She seems different, you know? I mean, she seems to like me for me. <laughs> Bro, this, this ain't no movie, you know. <laughs> no girl wants to settle for less. Well, she has, and we're cool, you know? I'm just happy I found a girl that's not all about the money. All girls are for the money. <sighs> I mean, every single girl is all about the price tag. Apparently, she has a high price tag, and nobody has come forward to pay for it yet. You're just jealous, bro. Okay, you're jealous. I found love on my own terms. This love of yours? Yeah. It won't last. <laughs> it's be sincere with ourselves. And pretty soon, you're going to come back crying. In your dreams, bro. That's not <laughs> happening, okay? I'm telling you, she's different, bro. Hmm. You came along and you stole my heart. How did I ever let this happen? I thought I learned not to let my girl What does that have to do with me? Now I'm stuck huh? in between in the love and reality. Why on earth do I have to choose? The truth is I can't live without you. Can't live without you. Nobody oh shit. Uh I'll I'll be on my way. Okay? Yeah, okay. Babe, good morning. Hey, good morning, babe. Hope you slept well. Of course I did. When your arms feels like heaven. Oh, <laughs> now I feel flasser. <laughs> Just hold up. Are you going out? Uh, yeah, I got a call from my boss. Something came up at work and I have to go source this out. Okay. 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 Get something for lunch when coming back. Yeah, sure. Have a nice day. You have a great day too, baby. Hey. Hey, babe. You're back. Yes. Mm. Mm. Ah. How did your day go? Went okay, went okay. So were you able to meet up? Yeah, yeah. What are you doing? I'm editing and sending my CV. Oh. Yeah, trying to get a job so I could be a supportive girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> um, babe. Yeah? Were you joking when you told me you knew some people at the Barry Lawson firm? I mean, it's been a while now. You've never mentioned anything about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, my links there told me that they will contact you once there's a vacancy. You know, the thing with that firm is that there's a lot of competition. It's very, very competitive. But I'll give him a call, though. I'll give okay. him a call just to remind him. Okay. Yeah? That's fine. All right, great. So, did you still get anything for lunch? No, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine, or I'll fix something as soon as I'm done with this. Okay? Yeah, that sounds that sounds really nice. <laughs> okay, while you're waiting, yeah. do you want to share? Uh, oh, okay. I was yeah. going to say notes that I saw that. <laughs> mm. I'll be done in a bit. friends call me Landa. Hmm. Landa? Are you waiting for someone? Yes, my friends. They should be here in time soon. 
see. So, um, are you a regular here? Not really. I just come around the same once in a while. Oh, I see. So, hope you don't mind I do you a refill while we wait for your friends. Okay, so um, I work with a media firm. That's interesting. No worries. You know, I have a friend that's been looking for a job in a media firm, but she has had zero luck. Um, I think it's this popular one she has been trying to get into, Barry something. I, d I don't know what it is, but here it's pretty competitive. Yeah, we don't just take anyone. That's because I work there. I'm a top manager. Oh. Yes, yeah, so... um. You should tell your friend to send her CV to Larry at gmail.com. I'll see what I can do. Don't forget, Larry at gmail.com. Okay? okay. Got it. Nice. I'll see your friends here. Hey, babe. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hey. Okay, I, I take it this is my exit point. Hey, you're so soon. No, 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 we'll sit around. I'm still around. I guess we'll, you know, we'll catch up sometime. Okay, see you some other time. Sure. That's your fun. Okay. Take care. Yeah, see you around. Yeah, sure. baby, let's have fun. Why are you late? Sorry, I'm so sorry. Did you go to being her? Good morning. Good morning. Damn, you look so amazingly gorgeous. Thank you. <laughs> I hope you had a wonderful night. As if you let me sleep at all. I don't like you let me sleep either. <laughs> Well, in my defense, this city wasn't meant for sleeping, so why should we? You get it. And so do you get me as well. <laughs> Alright, baby, I gotta go to work. Um, Alright? Yeah, I have to rush myself. I have a meeting at noon, so okay. I have to go freshen up. No problems. I'm gonna send you money for transport, okay? And do not worry at all. As soon as I get off work, I'm gonna give you a call. You better do it. <laughs> You're naughty. My, my. <laughs> Landa. Hey babe, good morning. Can you sleep well? Wait, wait. I thought you said you were just going out for drinks and you'll be back. Well, plans changed. Okay. I met a very handsome oh my guy. God. Here we go and by again. handsome I meant his. Landa, Bucket. you just can't stop. <laughs> okay, before you bite my head off, I have good news. I met someone that has a direct link to that Barry, whatever, that firm you want to work with. Lana, don't joke with me with things like that, please. I'm not in that mood. Hey, honey, don't. look at his face. Does it look like I'm joking? I'm serious. I met someone. Please, Landa, please, just stop. You're joking, I know. Stop. Oh. Okay, okay, fine. Doubting Thomas. <laughs> just can't Take stop. care. Here. Landa. Are you being serious? Miracle worker, that's the word you should say. Oh, honey, let's remember this is something your taxify, driver, boyfriend can do. Okay, so thank me later. I have to hurry. I gotta go to work. Mm -hmm. 
Wow. He wants to meet up. Who? The guy you asked me to send my CV to. Okay. It's in a club. So? Who meets up a potential employee in a club? Beggars or not choosers. Go meet him wherever he wants to meet Joe. Landa, I have a boyfriend and I know very well he will not be cool with this. Girl, miss me on all that. I, do you want a job or do you want a, a boyfriend? You know if we, just your boyfriend talk. And that just doesn't look like it's, it's, not, it's. I'm not comfortable with this. It doesn't sound like a good idea. Can you just go in and shower and go meet the guy? Hmm. What are you looking for since somebody's calling you? Yeah, I have a boyfriend. I have a boyfriend. Why should it be a club? What are you still doing here? Mm. Okay. Hello, Larry Ajibade. Nana Phillips? Yeah. Okay. Sit. Thank you. What would you like to drink? This 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 whole thing looks like a blind date to me. It's it's not really my thing. So my parents met over blind dates and they remained inseparable ever since. Hmm. I'm happy for your parents, else you wouldn't be here today. But this... This, this isn't a blind date. What is it then? You're here for a job interview. Wait, wait. Waiter. Wait. A, a job? A job interview? Tell him what, what you want. I don't want anything, please. Okay. Why are you in your office? Okay. Now, this is the way we run our job interviews. I didn't apply for a job with you. You did. I didn't. You did. I didn't. <laughs> okay, see, you, this, this whole thing, whatever you call it, I don't do blind dates. This is not me, okay? I don't have to. Why I don't, don't you do ask me who I work for? What? Okay, who do you work for? Barry Lawson. Wait. <laughs> Barry Lawson? As in Barry Lawson, the media firm? Barry Lawson. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Don't say anything. Don't say a word. Is this some kind of a joke? Or a ploy to get me sit to this blind date thing? No, no, I don't do blind dates. All right? Now, if I buy a woman dinner, then it's more likely I'm going home to take her to bed. Or rather, there's a chances there's going to be a second date. If I buy you dinner as a woman, then you know I'm interested. And in this case, I know you're interested in this job. How do I know? Because I have your resume on my iPhone, right? I know that you can kill anything just to get this job, just by merely looking at your reaction to the name of Barry Lawson. <laughs> yes, but they go to the gym. They actually want to get home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was able to check out a CD. Quite impressive. I will say she has a great position. Okay, I will keep you updated. Yeah. Good day. Thanks for coming. Thanks for the call. I would say this is the appropriate way for an interview to be conducted. Now you must be green in the business world because interviews can be conducted anywhere. Hmm. Well, I'm more comfortable like this because I'm a lady. Hmm. Apparently your visit the other night was really impressive and that is why you're here. Or would I say your boss was impressed with what I could offer to the company, so he asked you to hire me? As a matter of fact, if I don't say you get hired, you don't get hired. So I'm impressed, and I like you. Mm. That is why you're here. So you owe me one now. I see. All right, let me show you around. Thank you. Yeah. So what of Sasha? 
she's an idol to me. Like, I admire her a lot. Sasha is here. She's always here. Okay. And what of Barry? Barry is actually the reason I applied for this job. Oh, Barry. <laughs> okay, Barry's here. Barry's not here. Barry's always here. <laughs> what do you mean by Barry's here? Barry's not here. Barry's always here. All I right. don't get. Okay, this is it. Barry is on leave at the moment. Okay. All right. So what Sasha does is to report to him directly. So Barry knows virtually everything that goes on in the office. Okay. 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 Don't worry, I'll get right on it. Is that right? Yes, she took the job. Oh my God, Sasha Peters. I love, love what you do. I love everything about you. You are an idol to me, and it's such an honor to work in your media firm. It's not just a media firm. It's the media firm. Of course, you're right. It, it's an honor. He fed you the line about what we do, right? Yes, he did, and I promise to give him my best. It's all right. Welcome on board. Thank you. Get into it. And you get, into it. get the whole community contract in the last four years. Okay. You, you come with me. Right away. Thank you. At first, I thought he was joking. Next thing, I meet Sasha Peters. I mean, it, it was like my dream come true. He felt out of this world. Aww. Imagine me walking in my dream, friend. Oh my God, girl. I'm so excited. I, I still can't believe it. I swear. I'm so happy for you. You see why I said we should give it a try? I know, right? Girl, <laughs> we need to cheer to that. Yes, yes, Cheers, yes, baby. yes, 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 Cheers. 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 Oh, you need to see the passion that drives these people. Mm. I can't believe it. It's, it's like I'm dreaming. I can only imagine, babe. I'm so happy for you. You finally land your dream job in your dream firm. You see why I said you should roll with real men that call the shots? Okay, you have to stop right there, okay? Don't say anything. Girl, I said what I said. <clears throat> anyway, I'm... Um, Going to go inside. <laughs> Babe, I'm, I'm sorry. She she could be very annoying and dramatic sometimes. I'm really sorry. No, it's fine, babe. Okay, well, all that matters is you got the job. Okay, that's all I care about. Okay. So as I was saying, I met mm -hmm. Sasha Peters today. She's cool, right? <laughs> she is. Take away my job from me. Is that why you offered to give me a ride so you could scold me for a job well done? Far from that. <laughs> Look, I'm impressed by you. And I simply just can't watch a beautiful young lady walking all alone by herself under this hot sun. Well, my boyfriend comes to pick me. He's not here now, is he? You're so full of yourself. I'm just one guy who sees what he wants and knows how to get what he wants. Can we just focus on the road? So aren't you going to let me in? Not in a million years. 
Besides, the house belongs to my friend. It's not mine. I see. So, I'll see you around. All right. Thanks for the ride. Nah, you're welcome. Hey, girl. Was that Larry that dropped you? Mm-hmm. And he didn't think it was okay to come say hi to me? So, how was your day? Are you... Do you have anything? Are you... Why would you say that? I have a boyfriend, remember? Ah, yes, I remember. The driver. How uh, can uh, I uh, forget? Uh, 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 Yolanda, I will not have you talk about my boyfriend like that, okay? He's my man. I love him. I chose him. All you need to do is have respect for him. Respect my relationship. And if you can't do that, stay out of it, okay? That was a joke. <laughs> she can't be serious. After all this talk, she still didn't even answer if it was Larry or not. Why do you like stopping here? Uh, well, I don't want any of my friends seeing me around here. Okay. And babe, do you know any Larry Ajibade? Uh, no. Why? Why do you ask? Nothing. Never mind. You sure? Yeah, it's, it's nothing serious. So I'll see you after work, yeah? Yeah, sure. Mm, take bye. care. Yeah, bye. Trying to take my dreams and make them real. I'm hurting, baby, help me heal. You don't want to let me in. I know you feel it too. Though you acting like it's not true. I've got one thing to say to you. You may need somebody. Hey, <laughs> who was that? Okay, it was just a friend. Hmm. Always a friend. So you don't have a girlfriend. So if I told you you have a girlfriend, would you believe me? Ah, so that means you actually have one. And you keep pestering me to come to your house for dinner. Wait, wait, so wait. You want this pretty face of mine battered by some other girl? Is that the plan? You know I don't have a girlfriend, so <laughs> don't even use that as an excuse. Well, I have a boyfriend. Fede, come on. I, I just want you to be just come around my place, all right? I mean, we've been friends now, mm -hmm. right? Even more than friends. I like you so much. How am I supposed to know that? It's obvious. There we go again. And sometimes I even regret having you come around my work environment. Yeah, because it makes things a lot complicated for me. <sighs> You're not saying anything. Larry, look. I don't have time for games, okay? I just told you I'm in a relationship. That should mean something to you. Let's keep whatever we have between us professional, okay? We can just be friends and that's it. See you later. Bro, that's yeah. ridiculous, man. You ha you're kidding, right? You're joking. Oh, you know, I, 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 I can't joke with stuff like that. I know. Bro, how do you get yourself in situations with girls like that? Like, how, how, does, how does that come up? Come on, bro. I'm just trying to live my life to the fullest. <laughs> yeah. So, um, tell me, what's up with you and your girlfriend? We're going strong. Very strong. Contrary to the belief of some people I know. Don't be too sure. <laughs> now, there's this new project I'm working on. This new girl. Yeah. Oh, my. <laughs> Jeez. Now, you see this new girl? She's always about her boyfriend this, her boyfriend that. But pretty soon, I'm going to get her. Do you derive joy in sleeping with girls in relationships? Or are you just broken and damaged beyond repair? 
It's not about the girls in relationships. All girls will always be girls. Oh my. There's pretty much no trust and loyalty out there. How do you expect me to go outside and search for something that ordinarily doesn't exist? Secondly, mm -hmm. I'm not damaged. <laughs> I'm only real. Yeah. yeah. I'm a real guy who knows how to play games so damn well. Yeah. Well, I think you need a real doctor. You need real help. Okay? You need help. We all do, bro. Yours is different. Your <laughs> own is special. If I special yeah. help. If I yeah. An STD test every two days. Eh? I'm S, just saying, S I'm just, what? I'm doing. Hey, hey. Yeah, Mama, I know. Mama, I just told you I'm here to get my salary. I'm low on cash now. As soon as I get the money, I'll send it to you. I will send it. I don't have it now. As soon as I, I get paid, I will send it to you, Mama. None of your business. Why didn't you ask your boyfriend? I mean, you're always bragging about him and stuff. And how is that your business? Let me try and help you. I never asked. Thank you. I don't need your money. You don't need to ask. I don't need it, and I'm serious. Hey, babe, what's wrong? You've been kind of off since you came back from work. Yeah. I just got a call from home that my family needs money urgently. And I'm really low on cash because I'm yet to be paid. Ah. Uh, but don't worry, I'll, I'll figure it out. No, 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 no. I want to help. I honestly want to help. Okay, so just how much do you need? Look, I know if you have this money, you'll give it to me, okay? Don't worry, I'll figure it out. No, I honestly want to help, okay? Just no matter how little. And I said I'll figure it out, okay? Look, I know if you have this money, you would help me even without me asking. Don't worry, the time will come when you can help me anyhow and however you want to. I'll figure it out, I'll be fine. <sighs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, my nene. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, baby girl. Thanks, baby. Mm -hmm. Thank okay, you. so what are we doing today? Where are we going? Where are we turning up? Barry <laughs> sent a message. He said I should meet him up somewhere after work. So I guess that's how we're celebrating. Seriously. What? <sighs> Why do you want to ruin your day? Uh, 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 uh. Not today, okay? And look, if you don't want to come, no problem. Ah, fine, fine, fine. Ah, it will do. Just send me the address, I'll come meet you. I will. Be good. I promise. Oh no. All right, babe. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> how did you get the money to put all of this together? Uh, well, how I got the money doesn't matter. You know? What matters is your happiness. Aww. So enjoy yourself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I really, really appreciate this. Thank you. No, I appreciate you a lot in my life. Because I know for a fact you've made me a better version of myself. Um, I know I don't have much, but 
I, what are you doing? I'm asking you to give me some time to gather resources because you deserve the best things in life and I'd like to give that to you. What's she doing here? I, I invited her. Don't tell me this is the reason why you invited me. Wait. Don't tell me you've made the biggest mistake of your life by accepting this. Wanda, he wasn't proposing. He wasn't? No. It's my birthday. That's why I asked you to come so we can celebrate. Okay. Oh my God. You almost gave me a heart attack. Well, I'm here, so... We can celebrate. <laughs> what are we drinking first? <laughs> Darling, I just want to put it out there that these hands are not meant for washing plates. And before it gets to that point, I'll be out of the door. And then the driver is going to pay dearly for it. So what are we drinking? What are we eating? <laughs> uh, waiter. Waiter, please. Uh, please take the lady's order and after that you can take her friend's order. Hello. Hey. Birthday girl. <laughs> okay. So how did your birthday go? It went well. Happy birthday. Oh wow. Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. You're I can't welcome. wait to see what's in it. So tell me, how was your birthday? It was good. My boyfriend treated me to a lovely dinner. Really? Yeah, I had a good time. Oh, that means <laughs> I have to top that. Why do you have to? Wait, why are you in competition with him? Well, come on. I mean, every man would want to be in competition for your love. <laughs> well, I would advise you find another girl whose heart you would fight for. Because mine has been won over already. Anyways, thanks so much for this gift. I can't wait to see what's in it. And have a good night. Bye. Nene, I'm here in the toilet. Are you sure nothing is going on between you and Larry? Why would something be going on between Larry and I? Duh, maybe because he's richer than your boyfriend? Look, I don't have time for his money. I'm not interested. That's what you keep saying. But he has been sending you gifts left, right, center. And I don't hear you complaining or I don't hear you say Oh, I have a boyfriend. I don't want it. Or oh, your morals doesn't apply there too. Just let him be. Okay.
Hey, you. What are you doing here? I don't understand. Do I need permission to come see you? I thought we had something. Yes, we did. I like the popular saying, all good things comes to an end. Really? Don't tell me this has something to do with Nene. <laughs> what has she got to do with anything? Good. Because need I remind you that she has a boyfriend that she loves her very much. And all this you're doing doesn't intrigue her at all. Me, on the other hand, I'm very much intrigued. So she says. <laughs> okay. Why don't you come with me? So you can prove that you no longer have eyes for her. <laughs> Who am I to refuse a good meal? This is amazing. Yeah. And this rice is so, so sweet. I have no idea they sell like really good food here. Mm. I must admit, you've got good taste. Apparently, this is the only place I come to eat when I don't cook at home. Yeah, because there's only homemade meals prepared here. Hmm. Right. Did you just say when you don't cook? Like you cook? So, I look like I can't boil water, right? <laughs> <laughs> Not really, yeah, but something close to that. Guys can't cook, you're a guy. Hmm. On that note, let me use this opportunity to extend an invitation to you to come to my house for lunch or perhaps dinner at some time soon. Hmm. Um, I'll think about that. I have a boyfriend, so I don't think that's a good idea. Well, I'll give it a thought. Who is this guy that makes you don't want to have a time for me in your heart? Hmm. You meet him when the time is right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this is really good. so excited that you finally came around to taste just to have a taste of my cooking mm. thanks for having me okay wow nice apartment i must say i know right oh you know i'm just trying to keep up with the trend mm, i see <laughs> yeah so um the dining is that way oh okay yeah after you okay All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. All right, so um, here we have different course meal. So um, this is salad. Mm. I've got jollof rice wow. with some carrots. Have chicken here as well. Mm. So where would you want me to start from? Uh, the rice. Okay. First. Okay. Let me know when it's enough. That's okay. Okay. Good. So, um, want some salad? Yeah, sure. So, um, 
The next thing I have got the menu is chicken. So, um, okay, I got a perfect uh, one for you. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so Thank you. yours. Thank so it's you. time to dish mine now. <laughs> Smells real good. I hope it tastes as good as it smells. Thank you very much. <laughs> Babe, how was your day? Okay. Landa, be fast. I'm running late. Hey, hey, love. Hey babe, what are you doing here so early? Uh, I've been calling you for like a week plus now, but you haven't picked up. I hope everything is okay. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm sorry. I, um, I've, I've been busy and, and a bit under the weather. Well, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. Uh, I came here twice, actually, but your friend said you were arrested. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I have to go now. Uh, I could drop you. No, don't worry. That won't be necessary. Is there trouble in your little hell already? Ouch! Larry, what is it? What? What part of stay away from me don't you get? Yeah. Look, honestly, I've tried. I've been trying so hard. Even God knows, but it's not working. Okay, uh, uh, your silence is, is killing me. Harry, whatever happened between us in your house was a grave mistake. A mistake. Look, I didn't know what I was doing, okay? So stay away from me. Oh, no, no. I said stay away from me. What is wrong with you? Uh, 
I don't get what you're saying. Why don't you get? I'm telling you she's been acting strange for a while now. Okay, so why don't you just come out playing? It doesn't change the fact that girls will always be girls, man. Yeah, why don't you just freaking come out playing? Look, you see, all they want is your pocket. It's the cheddar, the money. You see the word love, it's still. I love that girl, okay? You love her? I do. Then be you, be original. Come out playing, okay? Instead of you living this lie all in the quest of trying to live some illusional love. Look, every girl has a price tag and you've got the money. So make use of it. Hey, Nene. I had you, you. What's going on? Nene, why did you quit your job? Because I got uncomfortable working there. You got uncomfortable. The same job you wanted more than anything. You just woke up one day and you decided to quit. Please don't tell me it has anything to do with that your silly blood boyfriend, Barry. And what if it does? Huh? L Landa, what if it does? Look, I'm not in the mood for this, okay? Please, not today. <laughs> See, it is very certain to me right now that you enjoy no that you love poverty and that your broke boyfriend he's per he's a perfect poster boy for oh i'm gonna make it and you want to what help him and build an empire vicious woman <sighs> okay babe I know I should bring out the ring first, okay? Babe, I know you might be shocked at, don't say, sh that's stupid. That's ridiculous. Jesus, come on. Okay. Babe, I love you. And I want you in my kitchen for the rest of your life. Ah, that's sexist, that's sexist. Sexist. Okay, okay. Uh, babe, I love you. I feel complete when you're around me. Could you please be around me for life? That might work. That might work. <sighs> Hello, Dad. It's okay. I should have figured. So why were you calling? <sighs> um, that I think I finally found her. <laughs> the girl I won't spend the rest of my life with. And how would you know that? Because you said that I should make room for serendipity, right? Well, I did, and it worked out. I mean, she's different, totally different to every other girl I've ever met. The first time I kissed her, I knew I wanted to spend the rest of my life with her. So tell me about her. Babe. Hey, um, okay. What are you doing? Uh, when the word perfect is mentioned, you're all I think of. <sighs> Every time I hear the word perfect, you come to mind. Because 
everything about you is perfect. And you make me very happy, happier than any other girl has ever made me. And I want to feel that way for life. So please, would you do me the honor of being my wife? <laughs> I, 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 I don't think this is the right time. There's no other time better than this time. So please say yes. There's nothing else I want in this world than being your wife. Yes, I'll spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, baby. Thank you. Well, uh, but babe, how are we going to manage your situation? And I, I just quit my job. Yeah, no, I know about the job. Um, and it's not a problem. How do you know about that? I didn't mention it to you. Yes. Uh, well, I got a call from the company that told me. Why would the company call you? Because uh, I run it. It's my dad's company, but I run it. I... I don't understand. You, you're supposed to be... Yeah. Yeah, a driver. Well, uh, I lied. But I have a good reason for lying, babe. It's no, 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 no. Don't get angry, okay? I swear, I had a good reason for saying. How? How could you? Why would you even think about lying to a woman you claim you love? What do you take me for? I'm sorry, okay. I'm sorry. Just hear me out, okay? No, 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 no. babe. Come on. What the hell, babe. Come on. I'm sorry, okay? It. Where is it? So you mean Barry is rich? Like rich, rich. Lana, you don't get the point. He lied to me. Why would he even think of lying to me in the first place? Who knows what else he's been lying about? Is his name even Barry? Of course his name is Barry. You said it yourself. He's Larry's boss. Meaning... Larry works for him. He pays Larry. So technically, he's richer than Larry. You still don't get the point. He lied to me. Why would you lie to a woman you claim you love? Why would he do that? I mean, what did he take me for a gold digger? No. What, what did I do to Barry for him to treat me in such a way? Mm -mm. What did I do? Babe, babe, I'm not going to let you do this to yourself, okay? Barry lied. For whatever reasons, he lied. And that is not on you, okay? It's on him. At least you didn't judge the book by its cover. The most important question now is, did you say yes to him? Haven't you been listening to a word I've been saying? He is a liar. I can't commit to being in a relationship with someone that lies. I can't do that. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, okay? Come, 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 come. You're going to be okay. You'll be fine. Well, why couldn't he just say the truth? Why would he do a thing like that to me? I'm sure he had his reasons. There's no reason. Just hurts. I'm sorry. It sucks at the same time. But look at the bright side. At least he's rich. Sorry. Anna, please. I'm sorry. About okay. what? What exactly are you sorry about, Larry? What? The lies? That you built this whole relationship on lies? You took me for a gold digger. Hey, I was looking for love, okay? And that was the only way I had to find you. And what do you think I was looking for? Listen, the day I saw you for the first time at the park, I went to propose to my fiance and I saw her with a guy. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm familiar with the feeling of heartbreak. And you think I've not had my own fair share of heartbreaks? Why do you think I came to this town to start all over? I wasted six years of my life in some relationship with some guy and I come back here and I'm in a trial and error relationship with you? 
I almost slept with Larry. What? I'm sorry, I... I can't do this. I can't. Penny? Just leave, okay? Just go. About. Do you know exactly what I'm talking about? I have no idea what you're talking about, man. Nende, she's a decent girl. She's decent. I like her. You just had to have her. Well, I, I didn't know she was your girl. Yeah, I had no idea. Would it have made any difference? Huh? Tell me, would it? Well, that proves my point. That all girls are the same. And without money, there's no love. I can't even look at you right now. I can't. We're done. Okay, we're done. rude. Aren't you going to invite me in? Or do you want to ask me all your questions while I'm standing here? Hmm. It doesn't look as bad as I thought it would. Okay, what do you want? Huh? What are you doing here? Well, for the same reason why you've decided to lock yourself in. Nene is a mess. And so are you. Don't you think this is the right time for you to prove that you love her and that you deserve to be in her life? But you were never in support of our relationship. I mean, you didn't like me. You were never fond of me, so... Well, in my defense, I thought you were wretched. Sorry. Well, I changed my mind, okay? For one, I'm... <laughs> I'm tired of seeing her cry. It's exhausting and it's breaking my heart. And secondly, because she's in love with you and I don't see that changing anytime soon. And you're clearly in love with her too. And thirdly, because you're rich. And with everything Nene has been through in her life, that is all I've always wanted for her, a comfortable life. So, sue me if that makes me a bad person. I promise you that's the only lie I'm ever going to tell you, okay? All my feelings towards you are true. And nothing's going to ever change that. I mean, you complete me. You make me a better version of myself. This past few days without you has been hell. It's been hell and I don't ever want to experience that again. I love you, okay? And I'm always going to love you. 
So, please, would you be my wife? Everything to you There's nothing that I would do 